Coach, um, apologies for coming back to Kama, but um, when, when he returned from international duty in mid-December, it was apparently he was going to be arrested for three weeks. And then the press reports are that he returned to training about a week ago or maybe a little more. Can you just clarify exactly what happened from the three weeks to where it became six or seven weeks? Uh, just exactly what happened. I can make it uh, uh, simple and easy after the 22nd of December where we have seen he couldn't uh, sprint to 100%, it was maximum uh, and we are having this uh, player tech uh, catapult uh, GPS data, it tells you exactly the top speed and the top speed normally of Karma is close to 10, 9.9, 9.8 and uh, you could see in a game or you could see in training sessions uh, maximum 9.2 9.1 and that is uh, definitely not the standard uh, what's related to a performance level on the highest 100 percent from karma uh, at the time uh, 22nd of december we just decided because we had our experience before uh, taking out two weeks bring him back out air back we said okay it's done now uh, it doesn't matter even if it takes uh, six or seven weeks uh, i want him uh, being capable to have a 100% uh, speed uh, and I want to see it on the GPS data, I want to see it on the on the uh, highest level and uh, that is what we see in the moment. We gave him more than less into the medical department. Uh, he came out of the medical department uh, I think now eight days ago and uh, where he was uh, recommended in a way that uh, it's okay, he, he is able to, to do so. We have seen it now in these eight days uh, but from the 22nd of December uh, till uh, the end of January he was uh, not working with the team at all. So now he's in and uh, good, it's now for him uh, important uh, um, after a long uh, time uh, to get related to this uh, competitive uh, soccer game and uh, good, it looks not bad but uh, we must look into it in the moment we need uh, definitely competition time uh, to get into it. Let's see what we are doing.